what is clutch control? You might have heard of it before. You know, I've no, not heard of it. I don't sorry. think I've heard of it. So clutch control is when um, it's a, a big, big topic. It's the biggest thing you ever do. But this will help a lot with the uh, the jumping on the gears. So this will take a long time to explain. It's like hours and hours to fully go over. So it's something we'll do today, next time, next one. Probably the whole lessons. Yeah, all lessons we got. It's just take a long time to go over. But we're going to first gear, and the main element of clutch control is we do a bit of gas and a bit of clutch. And what we try and do is hold the car still on the hill without moving. So when the handbrake comes off, you don't actually move anywhere. And like that. So if I wanted to go forwards a little bit, I went out too long, but if I wanted to go forwards a bit there, what would I do with the clutch? Um, you pull it up. Yep, how much? Just a little bit. Yep, how much is that? Um, just like a really, really small amount because then yeah. the. Like a measurement, like a centimetre or an inch or less. Or this. So it's like a millimetre. So nine and a half. Oh, okay, tiny. Card. That's it. So from kind of there, I would hold it still like that. Then I go a millimetre up and it creeps forward, a millimetre down and it stops. This is done because it gets used to the clutch more, you get a feel of where it is. So the clutch comes up, down, then it stays still, then up. And down, because when you come down the gears, that's what you're trying to feel at that point. So by doing this, this allows you to practice that more. There's loads and loads more to go over. That's just the first stage. But let's give that a go. So we go, <coughs> clutch down into one. All you're essentially doing is you're moving off, but you don't want to move forwards. You're trying to find the same point as when you move off, but you don't want the car to actually go forwards. Okay. So you'll get used to the feel. You feel when it's gonna, when it's pulling enough to not roll back. Like now, you roll back because. You've got no power going forwards. Mm -hmm. So if you do a bit of gas and a bit of clutch. So we're looking for the point when it sounds to the clutch of a little bit about there. Now that might go back a touch, but that feels about right. Because when I'm not doing it, it's harder for me to tell. But that sounds about right. It's a clutch of a tiny bit actually. Oh, um, about that. It's a little bit more. Uh, there. That now might go forward, but you've got to find a halfway point where it doesn't go forwards or back. So, let's just see. So, clutch down a tiny, tiny bit. Yeah. And just hand my off, let's just see how that goes. That might move forward, let's just see. Yeah, so clutch down a tiny bit, down a touch, a bit more, a bit more, a bit more, a bit more down. Uh, a bit less, a uh, bit less, sorry, down, so less down, 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 down. A bit down on the clutch, down, down, down. A bit down, 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 down there. The clutch of a little bit. These cars are fine over there, which is pretty quiet. That's good. That's is there, so spot on. Now clutch okay. up just a millimetre of the most. That's it, and down the same amount you just can up and I'll rebalance it. So down a touch. Oh, Sit them out there. Yeah, okay. It does take a second or two to respond because the hill's gotta work. That's good. And then clutch up a little bit now. <coughs> and then you still left a little bit. And then clutch down a little bit. Down a touch more, a bit more, a bit more down there. Out of there. Try and hold it dead still. That's good. Now, if you do brake all the way down, then clutch all the way down. So brake all the way, then clutch all the way down, and then handbrake and neutral. So that gets used to the clutch. We'll do that a lot more, but that's just not the first bit of introduction to it. When do you think you need to do that? Like, can you think of a time when you need to creep, stop, creep, stop? Maybe like in traffic, would you do yep. that? That's it, so pretty much everywhere in Birmingham it's like here, imagine that car come down the road like that, you would hold it still behind that back car, and then you go, you don't want it to stop, because this again, it takes a long time to fully go over all this, so if it doesn't all make sense now, don't worry about it, if it does, great, but it's going to take a long time to explain. Why is it not so good if in that situation there, that car came down the road, mm -hmm. and you just stop dead, and then go again, why is that not as good, it's just creeping, rolling, and carrying on. Um, are you going to be making more work for yourself? Yeah, that's it. So you've got to stop, handbrake on, brake off, set up the pedals going. And imagine that bus is behind you, it's much harder because everyone's got to stop, stop, stop. You set up like a chain reaction down the road, everyone braking and stopping. It's harder to get going, it takes more fuel, burns more fuel. So yeah, that's why. If you okay. watch how people drive, people don't stop, they roll, creep, roll, creep, roll. You can drive for a whole hour without stopping ever once, if you plan it well. That, that's a different topic about planning, but this is the first element of it, the clutch control. So, just to go over a few more things about this, and this will all come together, because at the moment this may seem like a big mess, well if it does or not, but it can seem quite messy and you put it all together, it all works really well. So I do my gas, I do my clutch, 
I haven't got a gas pedal, but imagine I have. Mm-hmm. And I'm holding it still, by there, roughly by there. Why is it no good if I do this for too long? I won't do now. If I do that for a long time, what's going to happen to the clutch plates? They um, seem rubbing together. Yeah, it's going to like wear them down. Yep, is it? that's it. So, how long, roughly, do you reckon you could do it for without it being too long? I know we haven't mm. done this, but just to give me an idea. Maybe like five seconds. Yep, that's it. Five seconds is good. So some people say like a minute. After a minute, your clutch is gone. You're blown into pieces. So the idea is you hold it like that, and then you creep, and you stop. But not for too long. You don't hold it too long. So you hold, creep, hold it. Oh, the car's going to creep. Then hold it. Is that man coming up here? Yep, so I hold it till the van's gone. That made more than five seconds. I mean, it's only a little bit. And then I creep like that. So it's only bad if you do it for too long. So like with this car, imagine now we're driving, I'll be creeping like that. When the van goes, I just carry on like that and off we go. If another car appears, drop the clutch, pause, go. It's very flexible. Yeah, like that car appeared there. It allows you to stop, go, stop, go, but nice and fluidly. The other way around, um, if I do this sort of stop dead, I've got the hand mic on, I need to go over the whole procedure again. So I do my gas, I do my clutch. And I'll move off. And if I brake, I've now got to do the whole thing again. Handbrake on, brake off, gas, clutch, creep, stop, handbrake on, brake off. It's really jumping like that. It looks like you're drunk because your car's jumping all over the place. <laughs> so that's the way you don't do that. Okay. So it's kind of gas and clutch, creep. I can't be on this way for them. Because it could look like we're trying to move off. So I know they'll be rolling, they drop into probably second or one. And then again, that's what I'm saying, cars don't stop. He could have just stopped and got around. That's a really clumsy way of driving. So, Balance it again. Then I creep, stop, creep, stop. If I stop dead, why is it now that I've got to put the handbrake on? Because when I was doing all that messing about that malarkey handbrake and all that, why mm. did I have to do that? So why can't I just come off and buy now and then go? Um, what would happen if I came off the brake? Because you, when you come off the brake, you're, you're not on the gas yet, so you're going to roll. Yeah, that's it. So imagine if I did that now, I've mm-hmm. give way, break off, roll back, smash if you hit the car behind or they hit you. Mm-hmm. Um, so some people try and hold the brake down and lift the clutch up. Why is that not so good, do you think? If I'm trying to do this, what's that doing to the car then? I think that's what I did earlier, wasn't it? Yeah. It like shakes, That's it. it. Yeah. So you can to a degree in some cars, but many cars you can't. So I prefer to see it in a way where you don't do that. So now I've stopped, what must I do before I can come off the brake? If I come off the roll back, break. that's good. So that allows me now to turn my foot off there and onto the gas. So the whole point of this disc and it takes a long time to go over. Um, you do your gas clutch like that and you balance. If for any reason I'm right now, brake, got to reset, start again, find the point, hold it again. Okay. Um, that's, for the moment, that's all you need to know because there is a lot more to go over. But if you do it all in one go, that, that comes in late when you do like roundabouts or whatever. Um, quite simply on a roundabout, you don't want to be stop, start, stop, start, stop, start. You should roll up, creep, roll, carry on, go. So let's try that again when you hold it still, and that will okay. help the, uh, the coming down the gears. So, what is he looking for to be able to get it to fourth? Um, F, we want. So, brakes, so brake clutch down to, and then keep wire back, down into one, and then we just. Checking, oh, that's it. Checking okay. the mirrors. And then right still goes on because we stopped. That's it. And then can we go still? Uh, yep. Yes. Yep. So big ass pick clutch. That was a car behind there. Can we buy for that car? Okay, this is why you don't normally stop because it's much more difficult when you stop. But can we go now? Yeah. Yep, so creeping away, not a big chance. That's why we're gonna know is go on to the bits where you don't stop because it's much more difficult when you stop and go, stop and go. So we're to start beginning the clutch control, so your driving becomes much more fluid. Oh no, so braking hard, clutch down, then one, so brake off all, straight up. Just because we're never going to get into it. And if for now, you can just creep, crawl. Oh, That's it. that must be the problem I was having. What's that? that I was trying to, I think I've been... Straight. So, just keep way back, well out to the right as well. Well over. Uh, is it going to move or not? Just nothing at all, no pills, you're good. You should just about make it out of the way, don't like. Yep, that's good. Okay. That's good, and you'll be a gas. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> yeah, but he doesn't seem aware we're even there, but that's good. Yep, that's good. That's great, okay. that's good. That's okay. it. That's it. That's good, loads of bikes. Is this one going to be in the way? If you just sit and all that for now, just back a little bit. That's it. And then roll. That's it. I don't know what's going on. They're all going to come out in one go. Yeah. 
this is obviously a weird situation to be in, so <laughs> I'll just take over the pedals for a little bit.